before we begin a word from the leaves in this part of the world color changes and not the trees but the leaves tell us winter has come the clip of music that is playing at the background is from madhumaluti or garden of dreams let's do some exciting mathematics in this beautiful season hello friends we have already discussed the first problem of these 307 108 109 and we introduced a method called combinatorial argument which uh, was used in the first problem and we saw that how we can solve problems in combinatorics without actually computing anything we can just use simple reasoning and arguments to solve problems if you have not seen the first video in this series of three videos then you should definitely watch it before watching this one so problem number 108 will closely follow from the uh, 107th problem uh it's it again gives us a series of binomial coefficients uh, this time it looks a little bit more uh, enchanting it's square of binomial coefficients let's see how we can handle it uh, it has 50 choose 0 square up to 50 choose 50 square so let's make a little space here and um uh, we have 50 choose 0 square uh plus 50 choose 1 square up to then 50 choose 2 square 50 choose 3 square up to 50 choose 50 square all right so we want to find out the value of this sum and as usual we will not be computing the actual value uh we will be using some sort of an argument to do this so first let's do one thing let's uh, split this into two portions 50 choose 50 50 choose 0 50 choose 1 square can be written as 50 choose 1 50 choose 1 the last one 50 choose 50 times 50 choose 50 now you already um have seen that we found this very important identity n choose r equals to n choose n minus r in the previous problem uh by the way if you were coming first time to this video then re recall that n choose r is in is sometimes written in algebra books as n c r which has the formula n factorial r factorial times n minus r factorial and it is the number of ways number of ways of selecting r things from n things from n distinct things and we do not consider the arrangements as different arrangement of same selection are not counted separately so number of ways of really selecting our things from and things anyway um so we have found this beautiful small identity combinatorial identity in the previous video and we actually proved it using combinatorial argument so we will use it here 50 choose 0 is same as 50 choose 50 minus 0 similarly 50 choose 1 can be written as 50 choose 50 minus 1 and the last one 50 choose 50 can be written as 50 choose 50 minus 50 now there is a certain benefit of writing this uh making this transformation so let's see we will have 50 choose 0 times 50 choose 50 so we have converted it into 50 choose 50 the next one is 50 choose 1 uh times 50 choose 49 
up to 50 choose 50 times 50 choose 0 okay now a, a very simple pattern is kind of evolving in front of us um, again we can uh, make an argument like this let's make an argument that uh, there are two sections there are two sections suppose section of students maybe and uh, each suppose first one is a second one is b and each containing 50 students so there are total 100 students in the class now we want to choose a team of 50 students from these 100 students so we want to choose 50 students from this class now see there are really do two ways of doing it you can uh, put all the students together and select 100 choose 50 or you could do this 50 choose 0 so choose no student from the first class and all of them from the second class or so in combinatorics or means plus uh, so the next one is you choose for one student from the first class remaining 49 from the second class or you could choose two students from the first class first section and 48 students from the second section so this will go on until you choose all the students from the first section and choose no student from the second section so this sum is the same as this one 100 choose 50 it's only saying it differently so these two things must be equal see we just proved it using arguments we don't we did not even use any particular fancy uh, computation technique so the answer should be 50 choose 100 choose 50 which is option a uh, thank you for watching uh, we will come back with the next video very soon